Hello everyone, my name is Sinner and we've got something new for you today. However, before we get into the video, I'd like to take a moment to tell you that nearly 70% of people who watch our videos are not subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you could do me a huge favor by liking the video, commenting below, subscribing to the channel, and ringing that bell. It really helps with the channel and lets me know that you're liking what I'm making. Alright, without further ado, let's get into the video. Whatever her name is. No. Visual attributes greatly raises maximum HP. Can we use the horse here? We can. Well, alright then. Probably not a good idea though. Let's put that as our primary objective. Maybe these um, small people? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's cavalry. Oh, no. <laughs> We've gotten really good at quitting out. <laughs> Okay. Let's do this. Turns out we're still falling. Uh, Trino's Lily. I should find out what those do. Oh no. Always stuck. Alright, it's Knight's Cavalry. Catch me if you can. We should go and kill those guys at some point. That has a lot of nice little uh, mini bosses. Attack ahead, then try target them. Nice. Now, oh, that's a blood stain. Oh, these boys, these guys have beast miracles, huh? Interesting. Well, let's ride through and see if we can get to the uh, get to the next checkpoint. Where we store as our mana. Health. We are riding towards our. Uh, we are riding towards our primary destination. Black blade, Knurred, huh? If I can, I want to ride around him. Screw you, buddy. Aha! We have a scuffed. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> the grand lift have rolled. Um. Is he coming over here? Can he get in here? Is there a side of grace over here? There is, actually. Well then. Let's uh, rest at this side of grace. Alright, nice. Now, here's an important question. Do I have medallions of rolled? I do, actually. Conjoin split medallion depicting a, a flame peak. Brandish this medallion to activate the Grand Lift of World, connecting Lindell to the mountain tops of giants. The mountain tops of the giants. The forge of the flame of ruin is said to be found upon their peaks, and it is here 
Melina wishes to travel to travel in resuming your journey together. Oh, let me look at the thing, kids. Now it goes down, turns out the mountain tops of giants is below us. Five years later. Very nice. Gorgeous view, indeed. Very gorgeous. <whistles> All right then, well. Let's make our way forward. Ghost trees? Ghost trees. Interesting. Trees that are here more in more in spirit than in actual form. The mountain tops of the jungle. Oh, it's another one of those walking mausoleums. Maybe this one's too frozen to actually do anything. <laughs> I just give them to you at this point. They're like, well, you know, the exploration side of it's pretty much dead, so here's the map. Alright. The Grand Lift of the Rold. There's a ruin over there. There's something over here. And alright, sounds good. Oh, and then there's someone I need to murderize over there. Sounds good. Well, let's head over here. Let's take a rest. At this side of grace, that is totally not a side of grace mimic. Alright, side of grace mimic time. Nope, it isn't. Nice. Let's figure out what we're gonna do next, though. Alright, let's do this. Who are you? Hey, you're that, uh, Anti PvP guy. Finally, we meet the tarnished who would be lord. Oh my. Why the long face? I fear that you were previously acquainted with this vessel. Well, that is most unfortunate. For he is dead. As for his flesh, he gave it to me. Shabriri, I hope you can make your peace with that. Shabriri? You were about to sacrifice something precious. The life of a fair maiden. That you would toss into the fiery forge. Only so that you may be lord. What a horrible thing to ponder. Your ascendancy requires her sacrifice. Whether she wishes it or not. But how would the lord crowned so be looked upon 
Wenn so ein Pizza Watch hier uns leben will. Chosen tarnished and would be lord. Dare to tread the path of true rigor. Spare the poor girl. And singe your own flesh in her stead. If you are prepared to show resolve and attain lordship through righteous hardship, then heed the words of I, Shabriri. Chosen, tarnished, and descend into the depths far below the Earth Tree capital. Seek audience with the three fingers and the flame of frenzy. If you inherit the flame of frenzy, your flesh will serve as kindling, and the girl can be spared, setting you on the righteous path of lordship, the path of the Lord of Chaos. Burn the Earth Tree to the ground and incinerate all that divides and distinguishes. Ah, oh, may Chaos take the world. May Chaos take the world. Chosen Tarnish descend into the Sikh audience with it. Well, uh, he's crazy. We're not going to do that. He's like, let Chaos take the world. Yeah, you know what happens if Chaos takes the world? Everybody dies. <laughs> Alright, well, all the co-op we did, we have a ton of souls. So, let's go see what we can buy. Also, evidently, we have a new possible parry spell. Or parry ability. Let's go to the round table, which they renamed to the Table of Lost Grace. And uh, I don't know if that's uh, something that they did in a patch or if it just normally changes to that. But we have round table held over here. And we have a lot of money. Hello. Uh, Gostock. Well, he just has a bunch of stuff I don't need. What about all of these things? Uh, we bought almost everything. Alright then, sounds good. <laughs> Au revoir. Let's go to the tradesman. Not the tradesman, let's go to the blacksmith. Hello, D. He doesn't have anything. No, no, Hello? No. I need to do better than this. This will never kill a god. I can do better than this. It needs to slay a bloody god. Oh, it's you. Don't pay me any mind, it's not important. Just lay out your arms. I'm just trying to kill a god. Let it on. Yeah, we need smithing stones plus nine. So look at was there a different one? Need a shield. Or this was good. I thought there was a different one that I got my hands on. But I guess not. Can I go? I'm gonna go with guess not. Alright. Is she still about? She is. I am pleased to see. Would you like me to hold blessing still aflame in your. As I said, 5% is going to make a huge difference. So. Back already. No matter. Greetings. Are you here for spirit? I'm here for spirit tea morning. I feel like I'm really coming to grips with spirit tuning of late. I can see how and why immortal essence exists. 
a spirit under the golden order. I can understand their yearnings, what they become drawn to. Master Hugh said it himself, actually, that I'm no mere apprentice any longer. Once again, I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. Moderica, the certified spirit tuner. All right, certified spirit tuner. So we need ghost for eights. Six, sevens. Okay, now these are bad people. So this has been nerfed. Oh, curtsy. We can now curtsy to people. All right, what about all the gear that we can get from over here? Because again, we don't like to use the uh, the runes we get from multi from co-op and such to level up. Well, you know what this means. The earth tree has burned you. Well, you managed to return. You know what this means. The earth tree has burned you. The fingers. Remain still, shaken by this turn of events. They are busy consulting the greater will. When they are finished, the fingers will again offer their guidance. But thousands, if not tens of thousands, of moons must first pass. No matter for me, but you. How will you ever manage to wait? My, oh my. Receive power. Not sure what thing. Is this the levels with arcane? Nice. And this uses FP to, to re, uses FP to really to unleash many wraiths that chase down foes. These great stored, stored, and that. Okay, those two. This is new. Bastard stars. Scales with arcane or with uh, intelligence. Nice. Waves of darkness. Great axes, hammers, great spears, and cloth weapons. And these two. Interesting. Receive equipment of champions. Or don't spell. I can just drive by infinite of this? Nice. Buy her hat. <laughs> Let's burn the impenetrable thorns. Heavens forbid. That is not the domain of mere men. The burning of the earth tree is the first cardinal sin. And you say you seek the power of the rune of death too? The rune of death goes by two names. The other is destined death. The forbidden shadow plucked from the golden order upon its creation. Uh, unleashing the room now would be unthinkable. The fingers would never permit it. Nor would the greater will. But here we are. The fingers dormant, severing our link to the greater will. The realm and all life in ruins. Impossible events transpire beyond the ken of the fingers. Who is to say that the cardinal sin must be cardinal forever? Go on. Finish the job. Take the course you deem most worthy. You must find kindling. Only the smoldering flame in the great forge of the giants on the highest peak in the lands between can burn the earth tree. But special kindling is required to reignite the flame. For the flame to burn the earth tree, a sacrifice is needed of 
one who envisions the flame and can lead you to the rune of death. Interesting. Now go forth. Let the words of the fingers guide you. <clears throat> Alright, well, the, the twin thing is doing their things. <laughs> so it's really gonna take them like a thousand years <laughs> to, to, to communicate with the with the with the with the greater will. Man, I thought the Senate was slow. Alright, so <clears throat> we bought anything we can from them. Let's go buy all this stuff from these isolated merchants. Um, maybe we can get lots of things from them with our remaining money. Hello. Back already. Unusual fella, aren't we? Did this aged merchant have something that caught your eye? Oh, you know what, bro? Already have one of those. I guess I'll grab this. We can just buy a bunch of these. Take that, and I'll take that. Bye now. All right, thanks, bro. Have a safe journey. All right. So there's supposed to be something where they've added the functionality where merchants that we've met get added on the map. That would be the... Oh, yeah, they are. They're just really small. <laughs> Alright then, well. I also like how the icon they use is the same icon that they use on uh, Fextra Life. Trade again? Yes, it's trade again. I'll take that. I'll take that, and, and that, and this, and that, and this, and that, and this. <laughs> well. You're a terse man, isn't he? Alright, well, we've met all those. Nothing else here. I'd like the map to be a little bit smoother when it's moving around, because right now it's a little sort of like you know, do this thing where it does this. If you're seeing that, that's not me trying to make that happen. Now, is he above or below? I can't tell. I think he's on the beach. Let's go down to the first. Let's go down to the first step. the quick way down. Ah. Over there. Oh yeah. Alright, let's do this. Let's head over to this emergency over here. Oh, that's right, he's under this. I don't know if I actually bought anything from him yet. Oh. You again. I don't want any trouble. You again? The club brought so iron round shoe. Okay, yeah, he doesn't really have anything. I guess we'll take his balloons. We already have a bow. Done? What? Oh, oh y'all done? Good. Then wait then. Goodbye. Don't hit me. 
All right, let's go to the Church of Kale. My assumption is that they always intended to like have merchants on the map. They just couldn't get it going. Ah, always a pleasure. Goodbye. Okay, we bought everything from him. Oh uh, yes, there's him. There's that a guy. Let's see what he has with the money we have left. He is north, north, northeast of us. It's about there. All right, buddy. All right, pal. Ah, oh, how nice of you to stop by again. Please buy something, won't you? Please buy something. I'm so hungry. He's a hungry boy. All right. Spend some more of our say of our reins. Let's, oh, cool. Let's go over there. Talk to that guy. He's living in dick He's living in dangerous lands. He is to the southeast. Southwest. Got these two gargoyle dudes. Two marionettes. Alright. These winged marionette soldiers. Trade again? Yes. We buy that chip in headband. Why not? Already got that from him. We'll take the cracked pot, and we are pretty much out of money. So let's head back up here. Now uh, there's where Shabriri is, and we need to check out these ruins to the south of us. We can check out. Uh, this as well, once we figure out how to get up there. Alright, let's go. We should go back to the Forgotten Land, or the Forbidden Land. And look around to see if there's anything we missed there, because we kind of just rode... We kind of just rode through it. Okay. Thought way of the game. Zamoru. Alright, friend. What's your story? Ooh. I see. That's your story. How do you like cold? Cold doesn't do much to you. Alright then. How do you like moons? Okay, that did a a, you know, a nice amount. How do you like this? Good shit. Okay. So, the question becomes... Oh, that's just the mini boss, essentially. Because they give us a lot of... Oh, they give us a lot of... Uh, they refilled all our flasks, so... There are mini bots. All right. So, what is uh, what else is here? Definitely lots of ghostly beings. All right. Oh, those are more common enemies, aren't they? Or do they just look similar to each other? Well, not actually being the same tier. 
Oh, it's a frost storm hook? Ow. It'll be easier to cross them. In theory. Take that bird. Yeah, there's another one. Die. Okay. What else is up here? Take that bird. Yeah. Ah. Well, there we go. I think we're going to need a slightly faster spell. <clears throat> this one takes quite a while. Instead, we can hit them with the stars. It'll probably do enough damage to kill them. The stars. But let's rework our kit a little bit. Memorize spell. This will work fine, too. We could probably just block them and counter. We'd have to get off the horse to do that. This calls 12, and Adula's costs what? 26. Alright, but we're gonna go get the Glintstone again. That should make our life a little bit easier. Filling with those faster enemies. That person respawned. So they are not actually a mini boss, they are a common enemy. Now, where's our stuff? Okay. Yeah. Super easy with the right tools. Got rid of you. Yeah. Okay, need to heal. Let's get that and yeah, that's that. Uh... Yeah, we don't need this anymore. Oh, we do want to still come over here. What materials are up here? Fire Blossom. Alright, sounds good. Have all these ghost trees. Okay, interesting. Not long enough range, eh? Alright then. That'll do the trick. Let's take a sip. Okay, so it's not gonna crawl up the mountainside. Now, is that going to refill our flasks? No. Alright, so we have the Zamor ruins. 
Give this guy. Okay. Nope. Oh, let's take a sip. Ooh, ow. All right, let's heal. I was gonna... I was gonna say, ooh, you get stunned, but... So we block. Oh no. Yeah, I was gonna say, oh, you get blocked, you get uh, stunned, but then he can get up again. <laughs> Let's just see if we can get away with it. So I think they, I remember reading that they buffed the Comet Shard to where it's actually really fast, too. Not super fast, but fast. Okay. Let's go get our stuff back. We'll ride down there, grab our stuff, right away. Catch me if you're gone. There's a lot of these guys. <laughs> We're just smacking them and running away. <laughs> Okay, let's, let's get a nice height advantage, so they probably can't hit us. Yeah. Yeah, they can't hit us. Uh, in theory. Yeah. This could work out nicely, boys. We're just finding cheesy ways to kill these guys. Let's see. As long as we don't fall off, we're fine. Sun. Ah, come on. Oh, they don't register you doing a jump attack. Well, they do. I see the way for him to actually start doing something. Okay, I think that's all of them, except for that guy. 
He's here. Ah! Okay. We killed them in an incredibly cheesy way. Also, these guys drop a huge amount of baboons when you kill them. Like an enormous amount. So that tells me we're probably here sooner than we're supposed to be. Zanmore Ice Storm. Okay, so we try to use the moon through that, it's probably gonna hit the walls. So. Let's get some room. Set it with two of these. Very nice. Okay, we got him. Let's kill this guy three equally cheesy names. That's yes, we're gonna use that. We're going to recharge, do another one, do stars of ruin. Then spam that at him until he dies. Okay, that works. Okay, so once we can upgrade our our weapon a bit more, raise the button. Of once we can upgrade our weapon a little bit more, we'll have more options on how to on well, we'll do more damage essentially. Okay, so let's place down over here. What is there? Are there other items just laying around? Also, can they get in here? Rhymed Rora. I don't believe it. Alright then. What lays down here? This usually means there isn't a boss. Okay. Is it a trap? No. It's an item. Smithing Stone Miner's Bell, Bell Bearing number three. Very nice. Do so we have any common items or we can level that up quite nicely? So that was worth it. Is there anything over here? No. Anything else over here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, that's all those are. I was like, huh, I'm hearing something. It's the eagles. Okay, then there's this guy. Let's go ahead and take care of him. Oh, get out three stars of ruin, huh? I think we might want to just do Dark Moon and Stars of Ruin. Because with the FP cost reduction to Stars of Ruin, they actually do a lot of damage. Uh, where are we going? Uh, this way. So I think we can level up now, right? Yeah. We can level up, so we might as well. Oh, 
that's high enough, I think. <laughs> Let's talk to Melina. Think not of the kindling. I shall see to that. All I ask of you is to make the journey to the snowy mountain tops of the giants, far above the clouds. I know I'm asking you to commit a cardinal sin, but it must be done to reach the path beyond. And that is the path I wish to travel. What is your mind? There is something I'd like to say. My purpose was given to me by my mother, but now I act of my own volition. I have set my heart upon the world that I would have, regardless of my mother's designs. I won't allow anyone to speak ill of that, not even you. All right, sounds good. You do you, Melina. Alright, so we level up again. That's good. Our health is becoming slightly better. We could farm those guys for souls. I mean, for runes. I don't think we need to. Huh. Hearing something. It must be up there. Yeah, just want to get up there. Do we want to find some stuff? Someone coming after us? Die. Take that, you damn dirty birds. Alright. More winter hawks? I'm guessing. Whatever they're called. Uh, who's above us? Hiding. Alright, bird. Bird, die. Pick that fire blossom. That's somebody else getting murked by the birds. <laughs> it makes them feel better that I can say they're getting murked by raptors. Praise the Erd tree. I don't see the Erd tree. The snow is too thick. Alright then, well. There's that dude over there. Oh, what's this? Arterially. Hello, you. What do you got? Somewhere smoothing stone seven. It's not. I need nines, I think. The guard and gatekeeper for those returning to the Oh, there it goes. I just can't see it because everything's so white. The snow's power is too strong. Okay, it's a multi over there. Nothing. That looks like nothing as well. Alright then. <clears throat> I'm sure we'll. we'll find it sooner or later. And what are you? Oh, you're just another bird. Die, bird. Right. Those birds are too dangerous to be left alive. I'm, I'm assuming somebody just, like, rides off and dies. Or they try go... Well, he did it. <laughs> the 
what are you guys doing? Hello? Never knew what hit him. And uh, there seems to be more over here that we can go after. Okay, that person froze to death. That works for me. Okay, two shot these guys. Nice. Any ambush? No. Now we get our healing back. Not that we used any. Right. So yeah, Mr. Flame Man up there. Oh, I remember those guys. I think we... We moonbeamed them to death. Alright, what? It's quite a lot of these guys. Too bad they don't actually pay attention to each other. <laughs> they were friends. Yeah. Okay, you don't have a follow-up where you like you hit the ground with that and then it explodes. Briars of punishment. Well, 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 well. well. And what is this one? Arterially. Do the briars of punishment require arterially? Goodbye. There. Oh my. Your whoop is very long. Then. <laughs> Catch this. Oh, very nice. This volcano thing. Gotcha. All right. Very nice. We have the briars of punishment. What else do we have? Underground to my head. Ah. So that's where it's been. That also means this is the... This is the side of grace you want to use. Assuming it's convenient. Yeah, it is. Nice. The beast eye. With A beast eye. Okay, ambush. Statue. No, nothing ahead. There you. Yeah, no. okay. So I can't do anything while that is on the screen. Sounds good. Okay, so what is here? Not a hidden pole. That's what's up there. Alright, good. So, we got this. And let's go rest at this side of grace real quick. Yes. Alright, so let's go ahead and keep going. So we sort of updated our kit a little bit. <clears throat> 
So what we got is we have two ones on our main hand. Then we are running out of mana. We switch over to the Moonlight Greatsword. And it allows us to continue fighting despite not having any mana. So we also redid our stats a little bit. So we have 24 Vigor, 4, uh, 24 Mind. Uh, well, we have 24 Vigor and Mind. And then we have a little bit of intelligence. We have intelligence at 80. And we are going to be primarily using the Carrion Sloisa to do a lot of damage. So we are very bursty. We are a very strong caster. So this does more damage than this does. But this is sort of our uh, hyper reliable version, if you will. We still have our main spells on there. This is our main catcher if we need to catch something as opposed to uh, something else. But we have our general use spells here. So we're going to go ahead and continue making our way forward. But, whatever we need to... Oh yeah, and how our equipment has changed. Really, we just swapped out uh, whatever this was with Radagon Sword Seal. So, extra damage from sorceries, faster casting time, and then a more equip load. Yeah, this is just how things have changed a little bit, but not by much. Alright, but let's go ahead and make our way forward. Pick up that rhymed row. And we want to make our way across the bridge. We also did a tiny bit of testing, which is why we had more than 9,000 Verdeans. It's not a big, it's nothing too big. So what is down here? It looks like there's an archer over there. This does look amazing, by the way. This graphics way out there. Uh -huh, we're gonna be up there, aren't we? Okay, well, let's go. Oh, hello. And who is this? Hello, dead man. Ball stashes of wool. Smoldering butterflies. Nazi. Okay, he's getting ready to shoot at us, so I have a feeling we're gonna need to jump. Or we can get down here. Yeah, okay, we're gonna need to use the environment to protect us from him. Or he's gonna kill us. Alright, sounds good. Are we too high? No. Alright, Torrent, it's time to go. We can get down here, potentially. Alright, right, now, if I remember correctly, we can just block those. So, rainbow stones. Yeah, we can just block them. It's not a big deal. Unless we get knocked off or something. Okay, sounds good. Let's pick up that. He's doing tiny amounts of damage to us, but nothing too bad. It's better to get hit by that than to get knocked down, because we might just fall to our deaths. Let's try to put something between him and us. Good, we did. Is there, is there a sight of grace over here? Or do we just have to go over there and jack him up? Okay, let's bypass for now. Until we have a sight of grace. No, let's do that. Let's just go over there and kill him. Holy crap, we hit like a truck. 